Hey, what's up, everyone? Guess what today is? Review number two zero. I don't know if that's the correct way or maybe two zero, but we're review number 20 right now. And this time we are going to be reviewing Intelligentsia. If you have a lot of the coffee world knows who Intelligentsia is. Um, it was founded in Chicago, Illinois back in 1995, um, but it was recently bought by Pete's Coffee and Tea. So it's more retail based. Um, Pete's Coffee and Tea also owns Caribou Coffee, if you know um, what Caribou is, but it was once one of the biggest brands, still is, um, but it's becoming more and more corporate, I like to call it. Um, but this is specifically their El Salvador single origin. Um, big fan of Bird Rock Coffee on San Diego's El Salvador um, coffee bean, so I'm really excited to try this one and see if that's something I enjoy um, altogether. So the tasting notes are apple, raisin, and cola. Um, you can see that there. Um, it doesn't say how elevation of this, but I pulled it up on their site and the elevation range this was grown at was 1,350 meters. The processing method was washed. Um, and as you can see in here, it's kind of a seasonal coffee. So it is in season. It was harvested back in December 2019 or January 2020. So I'm really excited to try this. Um, I'm going to let the first sip rip. And here we go. It's good. It's not a very bold flavor, what I was expecting. I do kind of taste the notes of like a cola taste, which is interesting to me, but it's not popping out with any specific flavors currently. Um, but the smell, the smell is really good. It does kind of have like a spicy aroma. That might be also the cola taste. I don't really taste any apple or raisin in there. Um, I'm gonna keep going for it though. It does kind of have like a different aftertaste. It's pretty acidic. Um, there's a good body to it, but the aftertaste is acidic. Um, I definitely think Bird Rocks is better. Um, and I did pick this up for about $17 for the 12 ounce, by the way, but it, I had high hopes for this and it's not as great as I was expecting. I would probably give this actually a 6.6 .6 out of 10. Yeah, cheers to that and keep following along for more reviews. Talk to you later.